Uganda's Vice President, Mr. Kwesi Amisa Arthur, has called on African leaders to work towards reducing road accidents on the continent through the formulation of policies that will create safer roads. Addressing a gathering at the fifth annual lecture of the Federal Road Safety Commission in Abuja, Mr. Amisa Arthur says the statistics of road traffic crashes in Africa is alarming. There's a need to reverse the trend. Officials of the Federal Road Safety Commission converged for its fifth lecture series to the theme, Safe Roads, a 21st Century Development Challenge. The guest lecturer and vice president of the Republic of Ghana presented statistics to buttress the need for an urgent action to curb road accidents in the continent. The disturbing part is that, as the court marshal stated in his, in his short lecture, that the low and poor countries, low and medium, middle income countries, are the ones that are most affected by road, trans uh, road traffic crashes. And according to the World Health Organization, as he claimed, about 3,200 people lose their lives daily, meaning that in a year, more than a million and a quarter of people die from road traffic crashes. The Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Mohamed Adoki, reaffirms the commitment of the federal government to ensure safer roads for all road users. Since this administration came on board, we've remained focused to the ideals of road safety, which I demonstrated when I personally launched the FRSC's Initiated Road Transport Safety Standardization Scheme in September 2007. It's not all bad news. As a Corps Marshal and Chief Executive of the Federal Road Safety Corps applauded the establishment of the Corps, saying deaths arising from road traffic crashes has reduced drastically since the establishment of the Corps. The trend from 1960 to 2012, if you look at the numbers from 1960, the graph keeps taking you up all the way to 1975, which seems to be a high water mark with the Dodge Awards and the increase in motorization that happened in Nigeria around 75, 76. And then it takes you to 1988 when the FRSC was formed. And from that time on, you can see a downward spiral of road traffic crashes in Nigeria. With a vision to reduce road traffic crashes and create safe motoring environment in Nigeria, road users will no doubt be delighted to see words be matched with action.